Hello, my big old birdie. I actually have no idea if you're even looking at me because you're just you're just a big old big old black blob on my screen with a bunch of stars on the other side of it. Um, look, I don't know if the, I don't know if you're listening. I don't even know if you've got ears since we evolved you up into this spacey beast right here. But uh, are you ready? Are you ready to finally become the almighty maxed out Paragon level 15 RG you're destined to be? I sure hope so, because that's what we're about to be doing. Guys, welcome back. Welcome back to our Omega Modded series. Yes, you heard correctly. There is a Paragon RG out in the wild currently, which means if I were to go and kill it, we can finally advance this beast in front of us to its maximum level. And well, it's going to be dealing more damage than it's ever dealt before. I've been waiting a long time for this moment. Guys, if you do enjoy the video, please go ahead. Push that thumbs up. Make it rain. Those thumbs ups. Now, we should probably address what went down yesterday. Um, yes, controversial episodes. <laughs> Not really. I just died a lot. I suck. I sucked yesterday. It's like my brain just switched off. And you know what? I can't even blame lack of sleep yesterday because I had a good night's sleep. I had a fantastic sleep. Maybe I had too much sleep and I woke up a little bit like lethargic. Maybe my body just wasn't used to having that extra burst of energy and it, it overwhelms my senses a little bit. Also, I forgot my RG is like my slowest flyer. So let's, let's go and switch this out for a manticore. And we'll go and locate this Paragon RG and then we'll do what must be done. Uh, but yeah, this uh, we're gonna try and um, have a, a bit of a, a bounce back today. Put it that way. We're gonna we're gonna bounce back with a vengeance. We are going to not be the Miola of yesterday. We're gonna be the Miola of the future of tomorrow. <laughs> We're just not going to die six times to sharks and fish and whatever else underwater, okay? That's the plan. Uh, look, I don't even know where I'm flying to, so let's have a little bit of a sus where exactly this Paragon Argentavis resides. Um, we're going the wrong direction. Wait, are we? Wait, I think we are. I think it's literally back in base. <laughs> it's literally just across the water's edge. Uh, yeah, well, anyways, I guess that's good. It means I can travel home nice and fast. What do you got? A metal door and a water jar. Where's my RG saddle that I'm still waiting for? Because that's really the only thing, like, between us and kicking serious butt. I mean, we're kicking serious butt. You know what's kicking serious butt? Have a look at this scorpion. That's a big old scorpion. Especially compared to us little baby scorpions next to it. Um, yeah. The one thing we are missing from, like, really giving our RG the most potential that it deserves is, um, like, a, a, a nice... Ascendant sad. Why can't I kill this? Okay, let me just let me just drop some right click bombs So oh that stego was like asleep. I don't even know what's going on down there, but let's just wipe it all out eh? Let's put them all to rest. We'll just clean up the mat the mess afterwards <laughs> And where is that little orb? I can hear it I Can hear you there you are. I see you shining there shining ever so bright uh, Fantastic there we have it nice uh, Cool lovely I love it. Love the bits out of it. Fantastic. So yeah, we are about to ascend our void RG, our space, space RG, our cosmic beast right here into its almighty form. I'm not going to waste any time. I'm going to jump straight in and do this thing. I've been waiting such a long time to make this happen. Here you go, you little beast. Here you go. Three, two, one, go. And there we have it. We have cracked 500 million. Is that 500 million? That is... I can't count. I can't count. That's 523 million. What a what a number. What a lovely number that one there is. Um, damage wise, I'm not too sure, but there we go. That is it. Maxed out 100%. And because I changed its name, we can't see the Paragon level part of it anymore. So we just take you have to take my word for it that had I not done that, it would look like this. You would have XV in brackets afterwards. <laughs> I actually thought that would stay part of its name when I renamed it. In fact, you know what we could do. Because obviously we are calling this thing void for the time being. It might change. Void. We'll just call it void. And then XV to account for level 15. That's a really not... That's a pretty average name, isn't it? I'm trying to think if there's like a cool spin that I can put on this. But that'll do for now. That looks actually quite tough. Okay. Well, we're going to have to fight like a god or a boss or something today to really like test this thing out just to see what it's capable of. Uh, but what sort of damage are we dealing? That's that's a truckload of damage. Also, that was a Phoenix Bronto. So it turns out, remember how my Manticore keeps taking damage every now and then just randomly at base? Turns out that's because it's a Phoenix Dinosaur that's emitting danger. And yeah, as you can see, it just woke back up. But uh, we're going to... We're going to put it back to sleep. There you go. Go back to sleep, Brontosaurus. Go back to sleep. <laughs> yeah, we're definitely going to have to test this against some gods, which just so happen to be what we're, um, I guess, focusing on as of late. Where's my little Omni... Wow, my inventory is once again absolute trash. Let me just 
<laughs> uh, this, this inventory does not stay pretty for long. I tell you what. Also, damn, we got two pretty cool hatchets right here. Uh, look, I'll just, I'll just go and drop all of this. You know the drill by now. Yep, there we go. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Okay, so uh, what I wanted to have a little suss on is I believe I have an Omni tool in here. Let me grab this one here. Let me pop it open. Let me... Yep, there we go. Do we actually have any Archie Saddles lying around? We do have one apparently. But is this, this the one that I was experimenting with the other day? It might... Oh, transfer it to me. Hold on. RG Saddle, transfer. Okay. That ended up in my inventory. It didn't. I guess it's the one that he's actually, yeah, holding on to. So we want to find ourselves an RG Saddle. The problem, of course, is that, well, everywhere we've kind of looked we're obviously checking all the supply drops and stuff constantly and we're just not finding them however there is an update coming to the mod very soon that's going to apparently summon in random supply drops around the map so that'll be really really exciting and i'm not talking like our uh, these ones here these ones here are obviously built into arc the supply drops that are going to be coming are more like your survivor notes and that sort of stuff like lying around on the ground around the map randomly generated apparently have a look at the big old mammoth down there um so those there might drop well, what we're looking for in fact it is also rumored that some of those will be actually holding Paragon Souls. So that's pretty exciting too. Uh, hopefully they come out soon because as you know, we are nearing the end of this series. Now, obviously I'm just kind of cruising through here really quickly. One for supply drops, but two, I want to find a lava golem there. Okay. All right. You got to look for these little specks of fire just to see if we can get the saddle out of one of those, because there is a chance that that happens. We'll say, have a look at this thing. An ultimate Phoenix Phoenix. <laughs> That's actually so cool. Ultimate Phoenix Phoenix. Obviously, Phoenix is an ability as well as a dinosaur. You got like Phoenix squared up in here. That should be like a unique variant right there. That's so sick. Uh, I got no purpose for it though, unfortunately. Also a fire fire wife. It's like somebody was stuttering. Somebody, like someone with a stutter named all the dinosaurs on this island. <laughs> we got a poison poison wyvern? No, it's a banshee poison wyvern. Uh, what are the chances of looking at two dinosaurs back to back and both of them having like repeated names like that? That is absolutely awesome. That is so cool. <laughs> Something so silly. So, so small, but such a, like a, just a random encounter, I suppose. Anyways, unfortunately, we're not finding any more lava fellas out here. What did we end up getting out of that actual loot drop? Look at this. We're getting saddles. None of these are an Argy saddle at first glance, though, unfortunately. We've got a Mosa saddle, a Megalosaurus saddle, a Dodecura saddle, a Paris saddle. None of those spell Argy to me, though, which is really, really disappointing. Really, really disappointing. Now, obviously, last episode, we went looking for unique dinosaurs. Didn't have a whole lot of luck. Um, I actually was going to have another look today. It actually takes a very, very long time to type out a hundred words into here. Like... They've all got different variants. Bolt was the Tyrannodon we accidentally killed. You had Reptar, who was the crazy T-Rex. Uh, there are so many unique dinosaurs that you got to type in. I think Swarm is the one for uh, piranhas. And then Static is, of course, the one for the little cold fish, which, hey, we got a stack of these guys. You know what? If you could actually tame up one of these, do you reckon you could ride it? It's possible. Oh, there's a prime static. Okay, look. All right, all right. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I, know, I know that there is absolutely nothing exciting about a fish. Except for the fact it's static. <laughs> no. Um, if we could get a prime static, obviously it is quite... We actually get a lot of... Oh, hold on. Gold drop over here. We actually get a lot of paragon static. Not static. Ah, we got a lot of paragon coal in our world. So technically, we could actually make this thing an omega. And we could possibly make this thing ridiculously powerful. I'm talking like the most powerful fish the world has ever seen. It, it could be kind of funny. It could be kind of cool as a matter of fact. But then again, uh, we just have come off a day of really, really bad events underwater. So do we really want to re-enter water and, and have the same kind of... Do we really want a repeat of yesterday is, I guess, what I'm, what I'm, what I'm trying to say. The answer is obviously a resounding no. Um, also, the thing is 200 meters down there. I ain't getting 200 meters down there. I, I kind of just wanted to see, like, what sort of stats it had. I so want to try it. And you know what? Mm, is this... Am I about to... Oh, we about to go for round two just to tame a stinking little fish up, guys. <laughs> I've never been so petty in my life, I swear. Petty as I am right now, where I'm, 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 I, it's, it's, you know what? I gotta show you guys that I have it in me to actually do this. I need to prove to you all that I can tame a fish. 
<laughs> it's been so long. But we're going to need one of these. And we have what we need to get one. Okay, that's a start. I assume we're only going to need the one kibble too. It's a fish after all. Um, we still got our beta kibble up here as well. And we also got gravity boots. Um, can double jump while wearing. Wait, what? Did I read this? I guess I never read this, but... Oh, snap! You can actually double jump with these. That's sick. Oh, there's a cooldown on it though, I think maybe. Hold on. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, there is a, there's a rather large cooldown. Uh, but I got a lot of comments uh, and messages yesterday talking to me about ways that we could have actually had a lot of luck or, you know, turned the tables yesterday. I had people telling me to get these, as a matter of fact. Um, void trousers. And straight away, I can see why they prevent you from drowning. They're unbreakable. Uh, damn, they're actually really cool. Okay. That's an option for sure. Obviously, the alternative to those, though, is popping up here, jumping in here. And this was suggested by Mia uh, that we, you know, obviously get ourselves some tech gear. Yeah, how, how obvious is that? And yet I just I just don't do it. Oh, because I don't have black pearls. Yeah, I can I can fix that, though, very quickly, can't I? We, we, we know how to fix that. We go and kill a crystal dinosaur. Should we just try it with the void trousers for now, though? Should we... Oh, I'm gonna get in trouble again, aren't I? All right, let's get these void trousers, uh, and then if we and if things go horribly wrong, then we'll um we'll come and we'll. <laughs> oh, let's just hope that things don't go horribly wrong, okay? Void trousers are on. What I should really do is bring down like a weapon. Also, you know what? If I'm gonna get this fish, I'm gonna get this fish. I'm gonna get this fish. We are also going to grab ourselves some taming potions. Or one taming potion. I only need the one. There we go. Um, we got our siren potions. This time I'll use them more effectively. But not only that. Oh, there's the RG saddle. This one here. Um, I guess I didn't imprint it. Or not imprint it. Imbue it. I crafted this up and maxed it out in hopes of imbuing it. And I guess I never got around to that. Um, but what am I looking for in here? Nothing. I don't even know why I'm in this inventory right now. I want you. And we're going to need some... Uh, what do you call them again? Gravity potions. Just to get down there. Gravity one? What's the gravity one? What's the anti-gravity one do? I reduced the... Okay, cool. So we want one to get down there, one to get back up. Guys, I'm confident I can do this this time. We just got to not be silly. It's, it's a shame that I'm not, not the best at doing that. But we're going to go for this thing. We're going to see how we go. I'm going to get a fish. I'm going to catch a fish. I'm going to prove you all wrong by catching a fish. I'm going to show you guys that I'm not useless. Or as useless as you think I am. Okay, so it's right down there. I haven't even worked out how I'm going to knock this thing out yet, have I? That's fine. That's fine. We'll work this out together. So... <laughs> oh, this is so stupid. Um, I guess I'll crossbow it in here. We'll throw a gravity potion down our throat. I've got my unique kibble. And we're just going to dive straight to the bottom. Okay, let's go. Whoa, okay. I forgot how fast we're going to fall. Please don't take fall damage. No, we're good. We're good. Okay, hold on. I should take anti-gravity potion now. Yes, that was perfect. Um, for some reason, I'm still very heavy. I'm very heavy. Now, can I use... I don't think you can use guns underwater. Anyways, I'm trying to look at the stats on this thing. It actually looks like we're in a fairly friendly area of the ocean, by the way. Um, oh, here we go. My spyglass. I wouldn't even... <gasps> Things got 14,000. Yeah, okay. As expected. You can't, you can't fire a weapon underground. It only requires one kibble. I can't even see this thing. Um, and I'm trying so hard to swim up to it. Uh, why am I hearing? I'm hearing attacks. Okay, I drank a siren potion. That should get these guys off of me. I probably shouldn't attack it because it's going to come and fight me, isn't it? Okay, I just want my fish. If you little eels can bugger off in the meantime, that'd be great. Okay. Oh! Got my wrong weapon out. Oh, snap. We're in trouble. Okay. Okay. My bad. My bad. Get me out of here. Now. Now. Now get me out of here. Okay. We're okay. Oh, that was a silly mistake. Okay. Maybe, maybe we... <laughs> well, look, we've got a teleporter down there, I guess. Should I just head back with my... <laughs> Let's go. Ki oh, you're a bad... I probably shouldn't bring you... I probably should bring you. I should bring something more like my dire wolf here. All right, we're going to bring our dire wolf down there. <laughs> Why are we doing this? I can't. Oh, pride. Pride is clouding my judgment, guys. Proud. Pride is clouding my judgment, and I don't know why I'm letting it. But we got to do it. Okay. I can't even bite these things. Why? What's going on here? There we go. 
Yeah, take that. Take that. Yeah, take that. Stinking eels. Get out of here. Get out of here. Bugger off. Yeah, that's what you get. Okay. Now, where's my fishy? Right next to us. Okay. If I dismount, my dire wolf's going to the surface. Wait. I don't need to dismount it. We can just fire it. Okay, cool. All right, let's swim. I'm gonna swim up on this little guy. I can see my man's core up there on the surface still. Got him! Did I knock it out? Is it asleep? I can't even see the thing. It's invisible. We got him! Yes! Okay, 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 okay. Just wanna suss out the environment. All right, you're going on the surface. Yep, as expected. I think we're safe though. So you take that. In fact, hey, you know what? Take one of these as well. Where is it? There it is. Bam. Yo! Yeah! And you can ride the thing! <laughs> I've got a little electrical fish. Get a load of this. <laughs> what is going on? Well, that's one of the more awkward things that I've ever witnessed in this game. Um, but hey! Are you proud of me or what? You can get a better idea of what this thing actually looks like from up here. So that's kind of cool. Uh, but we did it! Yo! All right. Can I... <laughs> I should not be this. Hey, 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 hey. What are you doing? Hey, hey. Cut it out. Cut it out. I don't think my fish can even attack, guys. Oh, it does. It bites. It has a really, really terrible... Oh, my gosh. Just attack the thing, Die Wolf. What are you doing, man? All right. We're actually going to need help. <laughs> I'm just going to waddle my way away from here. Uh, that's a Siren Megalodon, by the way. A pride one. All right. You can attack this, dude. Die Wolf. Finish it, will you? Die Wolf. I think he's got the siren ability working on him. I think that's... Oh, great. So do we now. So do we. What am I doing with my life, man? Why are we... Why are we doing... Why do I... Why did I go and tame a fish? Could somebody talk some sense into me? Because I clearly can't talk it into myself. Um, no, no, I take that back. I'm proud of my achievements. <laughs> Die wolf, come with me, man. Come with me, buddy. Uh, where'd my fish go? You can't even see him. He's like invisible underwater. Uh, speaking of which... So he's a wind lightning fish. Okay, I was curious about what two abilities he kind of combines. Um, there's the answer. He's a... He, well, yeah, it's cool. Okay, cool. Fantastic. All right. Now, I'm going to turn this thing into an Omega <laughs> for some reason. Um, just to see. Just to see. Okay, why not? That's, that's, that's pretty much the reasons. Um, all right. I'm going to just pop you into a little bowl okay now just remind me not to throw you on land because knowing me i'm probably gonna do that and yeah we're, we're gonna try our best to remember not to do that basically um yes maybe we can even ah oh, if we had like a pond near our base i could just like let it live in the pond near, <laughs> near my base <laughs> but what we are gonna need to like make this guy his pure, like full potential is we're going to need to kill these two guys right here and oh my gosh i just realized we're gonna have to head probably underwater to make this happen aren't we it looks like we've got at least a coal at least this one looks like it's close to the shorelines uh so we'll give it a, we'll give it a shot and we'll, we'll see what see what comes of it and then the other one will might need to go down to the bottom of the ocean but we'll, we'll play it by ear we'll see what we'll see what happens also there's a raptor saddle in there come on can one of these give me my rg saddle yes i also can barely see right now guys you're not alone anyways it should be right here are you right here oh don't hit the water okay that's cool that's cool yes he he's right here got him nice i think i got him did i get him yeah we did okay you don't want to be seeing fireballs and stuff flying around your face okay okay bugger off for you wait this is some dodo like whipping around look how fast oh it's a dimensional i thought it was wait did i not grab the orb I don't think I grabbed the orb. I could have sworn that I did. Okay, we got it that time. Nice. Hey, so now we can evolve our fish, our useless fish into an ultimate. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Okay, don't judge me. I know this. I know that this is just utter absurdity, but pride. No, <laughs> I think it's just a funny thing to do. Get yourself a ridiculously powerful fish and then evolve it into a god. Hey, it sounds fun to me anyways. Okay, Paragon Coal number two. So we're going to turn this thing into an Omega. So hopefully we can get to this guy nice and easily. I'm hoping it's like right next to this island. What do you got in you? A sword and a smithy. Great. Two things I, yep, not on the lookout for, I'm afraid. Speaking of things I'm not on the lookout for, I'm not looking for fish at the bottom of the ocean, but that's exactly... Oh, this guy's going to be deep. 
he is really deep um that's fine because i have a die wolf on me i think in fact wait i get there yeah we're gonna take a new down there can you sink fast fast enough that's all i need okay so we're just gonna sink it <laughs> and it's gonna kill everything that comes near it so that'll be wait i got a better idea you're right you know what we should do should set a teleporter up the top here um yeah that'll do and that way once we get down there we can just sell set a teleporter up the top and we can teleport ourselves back close to the surface because i got a feeling my megatherium here is going to abandon us at the bottom of the sea which is going to suck <laughs> it's going to leave me for dead down here even though we're a team and stuff um but that's cool that's cool we'll be able to work our way around to that so let's make sure all the threats in the area are poisoned due to my radioactive whatever this ability is i keep forgetting the name of it there we go i think we're pretty safe there's my little soul that we're waiting for um where, wait where is it there it is there it is and i think we're pretty safe so gonna grab it and i've been abandoned yep as we expected but we're gonna teleport straight back vertical pretty much going straight up in the end i might even be able to catch my megatherium no nope, there he is <laughs> he beat us to the punch so now i gotta swim oh i love swimming am i even swimming i have no clue i think yeah we're getting there we're getting there all right there we go nice okay all right let's get these guys out of here we're going home let's do this thing let's go and get the ultimate fish <laughs> So I can't keep a straight face while I keep saying that because this is so absurd. Imagine going and killing another element. Oh my gosh, I forgot this thing's gonna like because it's raining. My uh, my mega pit. My what's he called again? What are you a megatherium? Because of his reactive ability and he doesn't like water, he's gonna poison everything in the area. So I'm gonna leave you down there, miss my big old rainbow cloud. You'll be just fine down there. So um yeah, let's do this thing. Imagine though, you could actually turn this fish into, I assume, an elemental. I don't know if that's a true or not, but I should stop spitting fake facts. Basically though, what we are going to do is we're going to grab these two coal orbs, drop them in here, and because it's already a prime, what we want to craft up is one of these. Oh wow, it requires a hundred essence. That's quite a bit. Um, that's okay. I can afford it. Enter folder name. Nope, that's not what we're trying to do. I would like. Okay, I swear I just heard a fireball. I just want to whistle everybody passive. Um, but there we go. We've got the ultimate evolver. And now we want a, a Omega unique one as well. <laughs> this is so dumb. What are we doing? <laughs> so we've got the double whammy. It's oh the double jump. I forgot we still got the ability. I forgot we still got that. So what we want to do is we're going to grab our little fish. Uh, we're going to question our sanity. And we're going to throw my little dude right here. There we go. Now, I just want you to sit right there, buddy. What I think we do with this, I've never read it, to be honest. Um, it, it increases its rank from beta to alpha. I think that that is a copy-paste job that needs updating. A uh, little bug, that's fine. I'm sure it does what it's meant to do. I guess if we feed it, it now it comes an ultimate static. And then if we do the exact same with the Omega, it's going to be an Omega static. That's awesome. Now imagine what this, how cool would that would be if you were actually doing it to like a, a, a dinosaur that was capable of anything other than just sitting here in the water doing nothing. <laughs> imagine if you could actually do that on one of our strong dinosaurs. That would be cool. Like, you know, like Bolt the Tyranodon. That's why I was so excited about Bolt yesterday. But unfortunately, we killed it with an arrow. That was really, really bad by me, wasn't it? Uh, but anyways, that's what we were going for. That, that was what we were meant to do yesterday. And obviously, everything just kind of went a little bit pear-shaped, didn't it? But we're not done yet. Because what we can actually do is, I assume... Do you I can turn it into a god? Maybe not. Actually, maybe you can't do that. Huh. I never actually stopped to think about that. Uniques will drop one of every soul when killed. Yep, yada yada. These uniques get stat multipliers of both variants. Yep. Most of them also get the godlike version of each variant that they have. And occasionally, additional perks. They get the godlike version. Most of them get the godlike version. Ooh. Maybe you can do that then. But I don't know. Huh. Huh. I mean, we can try. Maybe we just try it and see what happens. I wonder if you can feed it both gods. Now, that would be cool. 
That would be very, very cool. Okay. So you're definitely... I don't even know where it is. At least the weather's cleared up. I think it's definitely a water... It's water and... Wind, sorry, wind and lightning. I'm going to do lightning instead then. I'm going to make it... It's static. It needs to have... It's going to become a lightning god. Plus, we've kind of... Well, I don't know. I feel like the wind soul is going to make it invisible. And I kind of want to be able to see the thing. So let's go. Do I have a lightning? I don't have a lightning. So I'm going to have to go kill it and make a lightning. Okay, that's cool. We got this. We got this. We got this. We got this. And of course, we're going to have an opportunity to test out Void's new... Well, I don't know. Damage in the process of all of this as well. So... Backspace all that. Find me an Omega Lightning. The closest one you have. This one will do. We're going to go and kill a turtle. Am I not turtly enough for the turtle club? We're going to go and um, summon in an Omega Lightning... Well, a Lightning God. Boss. God. Boss. 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 And then a God. Oh, dang it. I need a God Egg as well. I'm forgetting steps. Um, is this thing swimming? Or are you on land? I feel like it's going to be underwater. Where is this? Why? What? Okay. I think it died. It's taking me... Yep, yeah, it died. It's taking me to like the nearest other one. Uh, well, I don't have an interest in another one. So we're just going to teleport up here to the desert. That's the closest we're going to get to this Kano. <laughs> this is so much effort to go to for the strongest fish the game has ever seen. But hey, it is the strong... It will be the strongest fish the game has ever seen. So, you know. I mean, I think, I think that's a worthy course, personally. <laughs> <laughs> ah, and then we wonder why this series ended up going so long. We're dedicating two episodes to getting a fish. Anyways. Oh, that's only a lightning storm. You're not even you're not even useful. I don't even want you. I need a lightning. Okay. Lightning woolly rhino instead then. We'll try that one. Dang it. Oh, you know what? We're going to the snow. Well, let's go and teleport to the snow then. Turns out we shouldn't have teleported to the snow, but we should have teleported just to our little mountaintop teleporter up at the Colosseum up there. Doesn't matter though. It does not matter because the Woolly Rhino is right here. Um, what's in this drop? A gilly chess piece. Why can't it be an RG chess piece? In particular, a saddle piece. Just didn't want to give us that, I guess. Okay. Lightning Woolly Rhino. Bruh. Done. Okay, where's my orb? There it is. Right there. Got it. Nope. Did I get it? I don't think I got it. I didn't get it. Eh, got it that time. Nice. Okay. There's one thing left to do. And then another thing. And then another thing. But we're close. All right, my beautiful Voidy boy. Actually, I think Void was a girl. Uh, we need to chuck you up there. And then... Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Um, you know what we did? I had the 100 souls ready to go, but as always, whenever I end up running past my little um, dedicated storage node, this little thing, I go, yeah, boop, okay, keep walking. And anyways, I drop my souls off because I'm not that intelligent. Um, so, now we will get it done. Okay. Summon in the lightning bus, and then we'll kick its butt. Also, hey, look, an egg. Are you an omega egg? You are an omega egg. Fantastic. I need more of those. All right, buddy. Show me how strong I am. I like to know. Get, um... All right, I got no stamina, but it doesn't matter because you're dead. <laughs> uh, I guess we really didn't get a good idea of how strong we are. Uh, the answer that we obtained was very... We are very strong. And uh, brought myself a... Oh, you got to be kidding me. I crafted a god egg! I crafted it. I think I left it in the inventory. Yep. We, um... Lack, lack a lot of intelligence. More than more than I... Yep. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. There you are. Okay. Fantastic. Okay. Now, let's hope that that is the last time I need to return. Oh, that will be coming back in a second. But not because we forgot anything. Because my fishy needs a special little god orb. Okay. Well, now that we have everything that we need, let's drop the big old egg. Let's hatch ourselves what will be a wyvern, I believe. I think it will be a lightning wyvern. I can't remember what this thing looks. Oh, it's going to be a blue and staticky. I don't think our static fish is going to change, like, appearance at all, put it that way. But uh, let's find out in three, two, one. Yeah, that's what I thought it was going to look like. So it's pretty much not changing. I'll say, you ready for this? Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> Wait, why are you alive? You're meant to be dead. You're meant to be dead. Damn, things got a good amount of health. And that health is getting absolutely annihilated. I love to see it. 
love to see it all right let's finish it off with a big old nothing because i didn't have any stamina great uh okay all right if we can get that stamina back that would be fantastic uh where did it go oh i killed it oh fancy that eh great well my job is done here where is my orb though Guys, I don't know if I got the orb. <laughs> uh, no, I can hear it. I can hear it. There it is. I knew it was around here somewhere. Okay. We have the lightning god's soul. It is time to feed it to my fish that is literally the same size as the soul. <laughs> ah, boy. Who even, who even decided what we're doing today? Because uh, this is getting comical. Where's my little fishy? It's time. It's time, my beautiful little Omega Static. It's time to be evolved. Imagine if this makes it so we can walk on land. Wouldn't that be cool? That, that would have been sick, actually. A dimensional fish. Uh, but that's not what this is. What this is, is indeed a... Wait, I can't feed it. Oh, no. Wait, what? I thought it said that you could do it. No! Wait, 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 wait. Didn't this... Did, the, did I misread? Most of them also get the godlike version of each variant that they have. Does that mean I need both? Most also get the godlike version of each variant. Did I miss... I think I... Am I looking straight past a very obvious detail right now? Because it wouldn't... I wouldn't question it. Because it's something I would do. <laughs> it's definitely something I would do. Well, okay. That was a whole lot of nothing for nothing then. That's okay though. Because what I am now interested in doing is seeing... I should probably put a saddle on this guy for a start. I want to see how strong my little dude here is. So, I guess we could throw... <laughs> I don't even know how you would level this thing up. Do you think it could kill a shark though? Oh, wait. It's got... It should be able to shoot... Can it shoot? Yes! It can shoot lightning! <gasps> it's gonna kick serious butt! I just realized! Also, it's C attack isn't working. Why won't it C ability work? I forgot! It's not just about its melee attack, but you can... I forgot you can just spam! You can just spam! It's... it's. Oh! This thing's gonna kick serious butt! Oh gosh. Hold on. There's a shot coming up behind my butt. Speaking of butts... Um, dude! Oh, stamina though. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Go! Go, my little fishy! Get out of here. You can do it, mate. You can do it. Let's survive together. Um, okay. You're healed up. So that's, that's positive. I don't have any stamina potions on me though, do I? That's, that's, that's disappointing news. Um, but it's already got 62 levels. We're going to get you nice and strong. We're going to blast away all these sharks. Get absolutely wrecked, sharks. Get stomped on. Man, this I'm kind of excited about this little dude. I haven't had, I haven't had this much fun on the back of a little fish ever. Um, now we can actually survive underwater for a change too. So that's kind of cool. But yeah, stamina is going to be a, a thing. It's going to be an issue. Also, this Phoenix Megalodon just won't bugger off, will it? So if I can... Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm kind of... I'm kind of... I hear I have here I've been laughing about this the entire time. Why am I laughing about this? This is actually kind of cool. Four thousand man, this thing's gonna just deal ridiculous damage, and it's it's mostly thanks to the cooldown because the cooldown is just so darn fast of the, of its abilities, where you can just pummel lightning blasts wherever you want. Look, we're, we're literally just like fish. We're sniping these poor little buggers. We're, we're, here, I want to kill that. I don't know why. Just because, really. There's a manta out there. I don't know if I can hit. Yo, what a shot that was. Fishy. Sorry, mate. Uh, big done. Can I hit it? Oh, I missed it. I don't know what the range on these things. Damn. We snapped the living daylights out of it. 36 levels. All going into down. Actually, we should probably give it some speed boosts. Also, hey. Hey, we, we haven't even acknowledged the fact we can just go and kill another 15 Paragon Coals. And then we can get coal power-ups too. This thing will kick like, oh, okay. All right, I'm starting to understand the abilities of a, of a unique dinosaur right now. Imagine how good the Pteranodon would have been. It upsets me that I killed it because we'd be able to do this sort of stuff from, from like above water. Wouldn't have to be in the water while doing it. But yeah, we're kind of, we're stuck down here <laughs> if, we're to, if we're to use this guy. Uh, for whatever reason, I can't work out his second ability though. So it's just our X-Blast 
Unless that is shooting both. Maybe it, maybe it is shooting both. But definitely our sea attack isn't dropping a wind attack. Or yeah, it was, it was a what? We're wind and electric, I'm pretty sure. And it's, it's not doing the latter. But either ways, I like this fish. I'm just a little nervous about leaving him down here in the ocean. I feel like that's a recipe for disaster. Um, but either ways... I'm trying to think if there's like a good use. I guess in future, when I need to go killing underwater creatures, my little fishy here can take me to do them. Yeah, that's going to be your purpose from now on, little guy. And I guess in the meantime, um, I'll bring you with me because I don't trust you down here. Something bad will probably happen. Like if we got to go and collect... No, black pearls we can get from on land now. But if we got to go and kill more fish... In fact, he's Paragon Souls. We can just swim him around. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Guys, this what this this isn't the kind of what I planned for today, but it's kind of just the way we went. And I had a lot of fun. I hope you guys did too. If you did, please go ahead, punch that thumbs up, make it rain those thumbs up. But most importantly, keep on smiling. Have a fantastic day and I'll catch you next time. Bye.